guys welcome back to the channel if you haven't already please like share comment subscribe i greatly appreciate that as i grow my youtube channel in today's video we're going to discuss leather jackets we're going to go over a lot of different styles with them as you may know i'm not an individual who wears jeans at all so a lot of these styles will be more business casual a little more dressed up I'll also go over types of shoes that you can potentially wear with these leather jackets from leather to suede you know they're both leather so sit back enjoy the video check it out This is my Andrew Mark or Mark New York brown leather jacket that I picked up off a bid on eBay. If you are interested in obtaining a leather jacket and adding it to your collection, you want to size down, especially with leather jackets. You want it to fit closer to the body just to ensure that you have a masculine frame that v taper it's a really nice look when the jacket is closer to the body i am pairing this leather jacket if you noticed earlier with the shell cordovan allen edmund loafers that i picked up from the last video i think it's a really good look that sets off the brown tones and red tones that i'm wearing in this outfit This is a favorite in my collection. This is my olive green suede bomber jacket. Now the difference with the bomber jacket, if you can notice on the cuffs and at the bottom of the jacket, it has the stretch material to it. So it kinda cuts the body in half in a sense. You can wear it zipped up or zipped down. It's still a great look. And having a green suede jacket during the fall season, it's a one of a kind. A lot of people do not have something like this. Now the brand is the Pierce Arrow. I got this on eBay again. I've with, with suede jackets, you don't necessarily have to have them fit closer to the body since it's a more casual jacket. This is just a really good look around the fall winter, just with a lot of the colors that you see around you. And I'm pairing this with my merino wool joseph abu collared shirt now the men's warehouse they don't have the best stuff but i do like this type of shirt that i got from there i'm also pairing it with a cordovan belt not shell cordovan but the color cordovan belt from anson belts if you haven't heard of them check it out they're interchangeable belts they're really nice this is my eddie bauer brown suede leather jacket the suede is called seattle suede which means it's a washable suede where it can get wet and it won't distort the 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 leather texture again i got this jacket from ebay i didn't i want i didn't think i won this one in a bid however it's a great look for me again if you're someone who has darker skin tones the brown suede is a nice contrast, nice color to have during the fall, winter type of months.
I'm pairing this with a pair of charcoal gray Brooks Brothers wool trousers. I also decided to pair this with my gold signet ring, which I talked about in my last video over my ring collection, and my red carnelian pinky ring. I think those two colors, the gold and the carnelian ring, pick up a lot of the hues in the outfit. Like I stated before, the burgundy shell cordovan loafers to the Anson belt cordovan color and the men's warehouse Joseph Labou burgundy college shirt again it's just a really nice casual look to wear on the weekend or if you're just running into the office really quick to grab something do a little bit of work this is just a nice casual look that you can it's an easy transition from night or from morning to night really nice look and I also like the gold contrast in the suede jacket it just picks up a lot of the tones if you, if you noticed on the Anson belt buckle it's a great look to have all around <laughs> 